Okay, YouTube, what up? This is Brian Easy coming back. I'm just going to compare today Fraps vs. Camtasia Studio 8. So I was looking for a comparison and I could not find any comparisons out there. So I thought I'd do one myself and show you guys. So this is Dota 2, guys. First off, we have Fraps at 30 frames per second. So this, I noticed there was no input lag. It's, it's very smooth. And yeah, guys, as you can see for yourself, it's you know, perhaps is very really good. It does make really large file sizes, though. Uh, okay, and so that's Fraps at 30 frames per second. Now let's look at its probably you know big competitor, Camtasia Studio 8. So I know Camtasia Studio 8 has a big following. Now a lot of people like the program, so I thought I'd test it myself. And let's look at it the exact same settings. Uh, 30 frames per second. I've got the you know the image quality thing rounding to four, so it's the best quality. I got the audio turned off and the webcam turned off as well. So as you can see there, there's a little bit of lag and a little bit of micro stutter from time to time, but overall it's doing a fantastic job, considering the extra features that Camtasia Studio 8 offers. So it does compress the files smaller, um, you know, and it does allow you to record your webcam at the same time, and it does, you know. But it does have to render an additional time, so that's something to remember. Remember, you have to render an additional one once. I want an additional time. So, lastly, anyway, guys, let's look at Fraps at 60 frames per second. So, Frap at, at the same time, Fraps allows you to go up to 120 frames per second. So, that's something that Fraps can do that Candata Studio 8 can't. So, uh, you know, up to you ultimately. As you can see here, this just looks really good. So ridiculously good. So, uh, it, ultimately, guys, it's up to you what you want to do with your software you know both will take care of you both are fine both are going to give you good video quality if you know if you want the best video quality then I'd go for fraps if you want sort of smaller file sizes and better flexibility in terms of recording your webcam and stuff then probably go for Camtasia Studio 8 but yeah guys I just thought I'd show you the difference between the two and you know my computer is the specs are just right here so you can see I'm running a pretty beast computer also guys, if this helps you out, um, please subscribe. And also if you've got any questions, please ask them in the comment section below. Anyway guys, that's it. Uh, peace out for now.